What's going on and welcome to the FanDuel. Hurry up, my name is Tom Vecchio. I'm here to bring you three value plays to look at this week. They're all under $6,000. So let's jump right in. Starting off at running back, Miles Sanders from the Philadelphia Eagles. He's 5.9. I know he's been a bit of a disappointment this year. He's on my fantasy team, but he has a great matchup this week and he has a couple positive factors going in his favor. Going up against the Raiders, they're allowing 23.1 FanDuel points per game opposing running backs. That's the 13th worst in the league. We've also seen the offensive coordinator for the Eagles, you know, speak positively about Sanders and getting him involved in the offense more. So hopefully that turns out to be true. They get him more touches. This game also has a 48 and a half over under, which is certainly shaping up to be one of the higher ones on the slate. And the Raiders weak defense could present plenty of opportunity for Sanders. And even if the Eagles fall behind in this game, we know that he plays a solid role in the passing game for the Eagles and he can have value in multiple ways, whether it's on the ground or in the air. So Miles Sanders, 5.9, certainly an option you should be considering this week. Moving on to wide receiver, Jalen Waddell at $5,900 for the Miami Dolphins. He had a big game last week with the two touchdowns uh, for them, and he still leads the team in targets with 36 this year. Going up against the Atlanta Falcons, I think this game could turn into a bit of a sneaky shootout because both defenses are so bad. And speaking of the Falcons defense, they're allowing 33.6 FanDuel points per game to opposing wide receivers. That's the ninth worst in the league. And he also leads the team in red zone targets. So no matter where the Dolphins are on the field, we know Waddle should have a plenty of targets. And again, I kind of like this for a little bit of back and forth action just because the defenses are so weak on both sides. I think that we have some uh, some real value for Jalen Waddle this week, $5,900. And then finally, moving on to tight end, Tyler Higby is 5.5K this week. We see the Rams coming in with a slate high 33 implied team total. You absolutely want some exposure to their offense this week. They're going up against the Lions, a team we've always attacked in NFL DFS. This season is no different. He has five targets or more in four of the six games this season. We see him grabbing a good amount of targets when it comes to the red zone. So if you're not paying up for Kelsey, uh, Waller, or Mark Andrews at tight end, Tyler Higby at 5.5 makes a very viable option on a team with an, a super high implied team total against the very weak defense with the Lions. All right, so that does it for this week's Hurry Up. I'll be back next week giving you three more value plays to help you get into your DFS lineups.